been a long time coming, but it's bottling day, finally for Blushing Monkey, my Blushing Monkey wine. Got everything, just got done sanitizing 25 bottles for the 5 gallon batch. My hands are all wrinkly, I hate doing it, but I'm paranoid about it, so I let them soak in uh, the cleaning solution, scrubbed them out then, and then uh, I also let them soak in the sanitizing solution, and I still scrub them out again the second time. I've got a mixture of uh, synthetic corks and uh, regular corks that came with uh, some other kits that I bought. And we'll get started. Look at that, isn't that pretty? Mm-hmm. Time to bottle. Uh, as you notice here, I've got a mixture of different size bottles. These are turn of the century, uh, back in the uh, prohibition days. I got a bunch of these. Uh, they actually don't. They won't take a cork unless you get a real small cork. They'll take bottle caps, and I use those for personal consumption and stuff because I like them. The bottles are really cool and hard, hard to um, or easy to get labels off of because they're very thick glass. I also have a uh, my. Graphs. Oh, we'll start going here. But anyway, we'll start the bottling. You notice it's a lot redder here in the carboy, and as we get them in the bottles here, it's going to be a little bit almost orangish. It's just going to be a blush. That's why it's called Blushing Monkey. So we'll get a couple of bottles done here. And. Stop right there, and move on to the next one. And there's your first bottle of Blushing Monkey. You can zoom in on that. Turned out great. It's actually at about 1.018, which is actually a little higher than I thought it would be. But that's okay too, it's just going to be a sweet wine. Strawberry banana wine. Okay, bottling's done. I got the, the stuff in the corks. Like I said, I used a combination of regular corks and synthetic corks. But, uh, and also with some caps. Uh, here you've got 25 bottles. And uh, made the labels already. I don't know if you can focus in on that. Flushing Monkey 13. And 11% uh, alcohol. There we go. And it's always nice to have a little bit extra. Ended up being 25 bottles, and there's actually still a little bit more in the, in the, the carboy, but just enough for one glass. One bottle that's not labeled, this one will go for the State Fair. they got to be in the middle of May in Wisconsin. We'll see how it does. Um, it's a little sweeter than normal, but it's good. Oh yeah, it's very smooth. It's about 11% alcohol, not too hot, like a lot of banana wines are. Strawberries up front, bananas on the back. Cheers!